uh, listening is a big issue. It's you can listen, but not pay attention. I've been in predicaments myself where I've been pulled over and I'm trying to explain something and they're just cutting me off to the point where they asked me for a green card. <laughs> so uh, wait, 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 say that again to the point where they ask you for a green card. Yeah. And I asked, um, well, what is that? Because I thought my handicap cap card, you know, say give him my blue card. <laughs> he says, no, your green card. And I didn't understand where that was coming from because then I pulled out my registration, my license. I, you know, I thought, oh, maybe he's talking about the license. Maybe it's green, right? But uh, no, he was actually asking me for a green card. So uh, my friend and I were going to a conference, and when we got pulled over, we, you know, we had no idea that that's what he was referring to. But um, I don't know if he was being funny. He didn't seem like what he was. He gave me a citation, um, which I went back and fought for, and I did mention what happened to the judge. Um, but yeah, he did ask me if I had a green card, if I was, and he says, you know, where were you born? And I was like, uh, California. And um, so how do I know you're from California? And I just kind of like, wow. So yeah, it must have been a very bad day for him, but I just felt the communication wasn't there. He wasn't paying attention and I wasn't being funny. I just didn't understand what he was asking for. How, how did that make you feel once you figured out what a green card was and that he was asking you for, for that? Well, um, two ways. Happy he thought I was Hispanic, which I am. Um, but it kind of insulted too, because I'm fifth generation Californian. Um, so it just kind of made me feel like, okay, why would you even ask me that? I mean, I didn't know that the state rules had changed. At what point did they change? I mean, granted, I was headed for San Diego. <laughs> I don't know the mentality in San Diego is different. Um, but I did feel a bit offended once I found out what he was asking for because I didn't understand why. Well, I, I, I appreciate you sharing that with us. Um, very interesting that that was asked, that that was asked of you. Um, thank you for that, Anna. And, and please, anybody else, um, feel free to raise your hand, build on Anna's comments. Uh, you know, one of the things that we've learned over the past five years of implementing this program is that uh, different ethnic groups seem to have different issues with law enforcement. And we've learned from the Latino and Hispanic community that it's just not about racially profiling or being racially profiled because uh, of perhaps being viewed as a criminal, but it's being profiled as perhaps being here illegally. And the, the African-American community it, that's been a learning experience for them to hear that other other groups of people have different issues with law enforcement. 